Minor League Baseball now on the show as our road trip makes a stop in the Double A Texas League. Tonight, the rubber match of this three game series between the Arkansas Travelers and the Corpus Christi Hooks. So digging in now, Sam Haggerty, and we are set for baseball here this evening. Just a bit high with the fastball, but didn't get the call. Coming down in buckets, cats and dogs, insert metaphor here, and the forecast is not showing any signs of relief. Total agreement, Matt, in particular that pitcher's mound. You know, one of the things you have to really be careful, not just for the position players, but that mound gets awfully slippery and awfully wet when it becomes moist like it is right now. So the umpires are going to have to really pay attention to the conditions on the field. Three and two now. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Hit sharply on the ground to the left. And this is going to find its way into left for a one out knock. That is good. The designated hit is standing in now. Jordan, Jordan Cowan. Cowan. Swing and a miss strike two. Throw over to the bag. Don't want to forget about it. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Defense has got to be on their toes right here. Three two count. Runner on first has got some serious wheels. You know he's probably being put in motion. Line toward the gap in left center. And that'll get down for a base hit. The third base. At the plate, Mitch Nay. No. Well, too much bite on the breaking ball that time as it's well off the outside. Big rip at the curveball, but he comes up empty and it's even at two and two. From the belt, kicks and deals. And he's forced to protect with two strikes as he had to reach for that one to foul it away. There's a shin high slider laid off for a ball. You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first inning can reveal a lot. To second for one, relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. Stepping up now, Brian De La Cruz. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. This is line to left. But he'll hardly need to move out there in left as this is called in for the first out. Stepping into the box, Anibal Sierra took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. hit the other way out toward right field long run for the right fielder he tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out striding in Chucky Robinson he's yet to get into the hit column in the series 0 for 7 the 1 1 home hit back toward the mound and that finds its way through for a base hit So now to the plate, J.J. Matajevic got him looking, and that ends the inning. New inning set to get underway, and here comes the first baseman, Nick Zamorelli. Too close for comfort, and he did a good job just to make contact. He's caught looking at a beautiful curveball there as that buckled him for the first out of the inning. 
the left field. Coming to the plate now, Jack Larson. Swinging it well so far in this series. He's three for nine. A ball and two strikes. No score here as we play inning number two. Breaking ball. Called third strike as that catches the zone for out number two. At the plate, Eric Filia. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Hit on the ground out to short. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. So coming to the plate, Colton Shaver. He did not play last night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Well, you don't need us to tell you it's really starting to come down out there. I can't imagine the umpires will let this go too much longer if it doesn't ease up. Yeah, Matt, right now this doesn't look too good. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we don't see the umpires come out and bring the ground crew out here. The infield, around the mound, and around the home plate area is really getting soaking wet. And I can't anticipate this going on very much longer. Now the 2-1. Strike two, swinging. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel to that one. Hit in the air out to center field. Center fielder on the run. He gets there, and that's the second out. And here now is Dustin Garno. Trying to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Here's the 2 1 home. This is a good at bat so far here with two away. If you're going to go down one, two, three, at least make the guy work for it. He's doing that, and he's even gotten himself into a good hitter's count now. Now the three and two pitch. He loses him on ball four. Digging in, Osvaldo Duarte. He had a couple of hits in that ball game last night. Duarte. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Fooled with the curveball there, and it's strike two. Now a fastball awfully close, but he doesn't get the call. It's two and two now. He chases out of the zone for strike three, and that's the third out of the inning. Into the box now, Joseph Odom. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. This is skied into short left center. Sierra retreats to the outfield grass, and he has it for round number one. Striding into the box, number 36 is back in the starting lineup for this one after sitting out last night's game. Bouncer to the left side. And oh, the throw pulls the first baseman off the bag, and he'll reach it first. Now batter. So it's a runner at first as a result of the throwing error. And set to go is the second baseman, Sam Haggerty. Here's the pitch on two and two. Pulled toward right center field. De La Cruz is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Digging in for his second at bat, Cesar Asturias. Third inning, no score to this point. A little early, and now it's even at two and two. And he holds off on the breaking ball, so the count runs full. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. And he lost him here on 3-2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. Striding forward now is the DH, Jordan Cowan. He singled his last time up. Here's the 1-1. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. The run comes across to score, and they jump ahead 1-0. Now that the third baseman, Mitch. Stepping in now, Mitch Name. 
three and one. Not a good spot to be in right now. Pitcher's falling behind in the count with a guy up that hits really well with runners in scoring position. Out of the stretch, the three-two home. Swing and a liner. Foul. Here's the payoff pitch. And he got him. Minimizing the damage at just a run. The inning is over. So striding in, Jake Myers. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. And he comes back with a fastball, one and two now. Swing and a ground ball to third. Gonna be a tough play. And that's out number one. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Brian De La Cruz hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. And the pitch on two and one. High in the air out to center field. Number 36 is there and he'll bring this one in. Now at the plate, Andabel Sierra. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Bases are empty here with two men out. Breaking ball called just a bit low. Over at the knees, and that's the second strike. Here now the 2 2. It's looked at, and the count moves full. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. And here's a ball hit in the air. But this will land out there just foul. The next 3-2. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. set for the start of the fourth and next to bat will be the first baseman Nick Zamorelli a high fastball is in there hit hard on the ground a second he's right there throw to first in time one gone here in the fourth at the plate, Jack Larson. First time up, he went down looking. One out, nobody on. And it's one and two. Hey, I don't mind that take right there. That was a nasty breaking ball. Started outside the zone, pop. Ouch, that one hit him. Digging in to try it again. Eric Fillion. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result. That's his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. Oh, uh, you can tell he wanted to hold off, but he swings through the inside pitch anyway, and he becomes out number two. The bat. The catcher. Striding in once Joseph. again, Joseph Odom. Odom. So far, 0 for 1 with a fly out. Swing and a miss, and it's a ball and two strikes here. Popped up. Matajevic is there for it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And next to hit is the catcher, Chucky Robinson. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. Popped up. Zamorelli in foul ground. And no one will track it down. This guy's been throwing the ball great so far, but it's going to be tested here. Four, five, and six coming up this part of the lineup. And this is swung on and missed, and this fourth inning will start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout. And there's one away. Into his motion. Here comes the three and one. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number two. 
stepping up to the plate, Colton Shaver. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Oh, looked like he was towing an anchor there, one and two. Boy, he looks strong up there on the mound this inning. He's got a chance to punch out the side. Got him looking, and that'll do it. The inning is over. Digging in now, number 36. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. The 1-1 one, one home. Is a fastball down below the knees. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Big swing, but a little dribbler here to the right side of the mound. And the leadoff man in the inning will get the job done here. It's an infield single. Now Sam Haggerty. Into the box, Sam Haggerty. And there's a line drive. Base hit to left field. And the throw will go to second as they get the force out. Ready once again, Cesar is tourist. It was a walk in his last trip. Cesar is tourist. The 1-1 one, one home. Ground ball right side. Reined in. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Into the box. Jordan Cowan. Runner in scoring position with Sugar. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. Here's the one two. Now a swing and a ball popped in the air back behind short. Sierra will put this one away and the side is retired. With the play, Corey Jokes comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. 1 1. Swing and a miss. Five straight strikeouts now, and there's one gone. Next will be the designated hitter, Dustin Garno. And this one's up around the eyes, two and one. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Breaking ball outside. He lost him ball four. Stepping in, Osvaldo Duarte looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Hops this one up, and that's in there. Base hit. At the plate now, Jake Myers. To two balls and two strikes now. Trying to nibble here and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. I don't think he can afford another base runner here. So whatever pitch he feels best about, whichever one he feels most comfortable with, that's the one I expect him to turn to. Payoff pitch home. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And the run will score on the sacrifice fly as that'll square things at one to one. So we're back to even now after the sack fly. And next it'll be the outfielder, Brian De La Cruz.
One and two now as that one's fouled off. From the belt, kicks and deals. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. Blake Taylor takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 62. Top half of the sixth about to get started, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Mitch Nay. A nasty breaking ball swung on in the dirt. He'll throw down to first, one away. Digging in once again, Nick Zamorelli. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Bases are empty, one man out. Just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. The one two. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back to back punch outs here to the first two now men he faces Lucky. out of the bullpen. Jack Northfield. The one one is taken for ball two. is low here so the count goes to three and one hard hit ball to short and that's through for a base hit make him one for two in this one throw into second the tag and they'll get him at second and with that the side is retired Anthony Masevich enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 84, Anthony Masevich. Standing in now, Annabelle Sierra. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Left fielder is on the move. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Ready for another shot now. Chucky Robinson, one for two. He singled and struck out in two trips. Now the one and one pitch is laid off for ball two. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. Hit the other way out toward right field. Philia is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. So here's the cleanup hitter, J.J. Matajevic. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. And he'll lunge out of the crouch to put this one away. Good reactions there, and the inning is over. Gabriel Valdez is on his way into the ballgame now as he'll be making his 50th appearance of the year. Seventh inning ready to roll and standing in the outfielder Eric Filia. Line towards center field. Myers is right there one down. Standing in, Joseph Odom. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, he's got to make an adjustment. You could tell this guy's been struggling with the bat in his hands. He's got a lot of frustration. He's gripping the bat too tight. He needs to relax, take a deep breath, and have a productive A.B. right here. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. The center fielder. Stepping in, number 36, one for two on his line so far in the game. The one-two. Turned on that one and crushed it, just pulled it a little foul. Now another one-two. He was looking for a swing and a miss breaker right there, but left that one in the zone that got fouled off. Here he comes again, one, two. Frozen on strike three for the final out of the inning.
Stepping into the box, Colton Shaver. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Crowd gets up for the 3 2. And he lays off. Ball four. Now the potential go ahead run is on base here. Ready now, Corey Jokes. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. The 1 2. Gets him looking. Strike three. Now at the plate, Dustin Garno. Now batting. The designated hitter. Dustin Garno. Ready with the 1 1 pitch. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. We could see the runner in motion here on a 3 2 count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing at, and if not, it's ball four anyways. Zamorelli is over, and he tucks it away for the second out. Now Digging in and looking for more, Osvaldo Duarte. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. A 1 1 home. It is swung on and missed for strike number two. Two out with the possible go ahead run at first. Look out. That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. Good job to lay off that one two breaking ball. Put himself right back in this at bat. Just out in front of that one, still two and two. Here's a swing and a long drive high in the air and deep to center field. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Now back to the top of the lineup. In Sam Haggerty. He reached on a fielder's choice previously. The 1 1. Line drive to left. And this is going to get down for what should be extra bases. And there's your potential go-ahead run. And your go-ahead run is in at second base here with a leadoff double. Now the Cesar is At the plate, Cesar is tourist. Fastball well outside. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Called strike, and that'll run it full. <laughs> Lifted down the line and left. And that will end up a foul ball. Looped out toward third. And this will be no problem over at third. And there's the first out. Standing in, Jordan Cowan. Two hits and three at bats for him in this one. The 1 1. There's a fastball that misses. Two and two. Love the fact the pitcher challenged him in that spot right there. Didn't love the location. But I got to be honest with you. I think he's got him on his heels right now. Don't be shocked if he attacks his own again. Full count three and two. And the payoff pitch. And there's a line drive. Base hit to left field. 
throw comes in quickly here, so that'll hold that go-ahead run at third now with still only one away. Now that third base. Mitch. No. To the plate now. Mitch name. And he misses with it. Ball four, so that'll load the bases, and now he's really going to need to get a ground ball. Now in the box, Nick Zamorelli. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. 1-1. Oh, one, one. Oh, and he hammers it to deep right field. Looking up is the right fielder. Still ranging back. Gone! It's a grand slam! Dean Dietz gets the call as he'll pitch with one gone in the top of the eighth. Number 74. In now, Jack Larson. The count now at two and two. And now, pitch on the way. And now, this ball's in the air to deep right field. And that is off the wall. He'll get it into second, but he'll be in there with a double. Now, that the right fielder. Eric Filia. Into the box now. Eric Filia. Pulled toward right center field. Myers is there now, and he has it. Two gone. Settling in now. Joseph Odom. He got under one and popped out his last time up. Yeah, I don't mind him trying to drive the ball in the air, but he can't collapse the backside, and that's exactly what he did in his last at bat. Look for him to stay a little taller and keep that upper half a little bit more over. Full count now. He's set, and the payoff pitch. Hit high and deep out to straightaway left. Left fielder looking up to the track, to the wall. Gone! So now to the plate, number 36. Ball low as he's able to lay off the slider. It's clear he just hasn't been able to find any rhythm out there. Pretty much unable to hit any of his spots. And now he's at three and one, and he's put him into another great hitting count. Duarte is there to put it away and finally put an end to the inning. of the inning now and at the plate will be the speedy outfielder Jake Myers it doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings down by a bundle it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one now a ball lined to the left side foul the 2-2 A swing and a fly ball, but no chance to run it down. It's a foul ball. And he fouls this one off. Another try at 2 2. Softly hit to short. He's got to hurry. And there's one down now. At the plate, Ryan De La Cruz. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. And this one's high and tight, backing him up two and one. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Softly hit out to short, and that'll be the second out. Into the box now, Anibal Sierra. He flew out in his last at bat. The three and one pitch he is in there for a full count now, three and two. Hit the other way out toward right field. 
Philia is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. So the lineup flips over and digging in Sam Haggerty. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah it's been an offensive explosion for him today. There's a fight at the bat rack. Everyone seems to be putting barrel on baseball in this lineup. Uh, they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses the for the first out. Shortstop. Cesar is Curtis Jr. The 1-1. One -one. It's looked at for ball number two. And he misses again, ball three. One out, nobody on. Hard on the ground towards short. And the base hit is that's into left, and they've got themselves a base runner. Into the box, Jordan Cowan goes the other way with it as this is in the air down the line and left. Jokes is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. So now it'll be the four hole the hitter, Mitch Nay. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. Hit to third. He's got it. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Wyatt Mills, a right-handed reliever standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Wyatt. Now at the plate, Chucky Robinson. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. The 2-1 home is offered at and missed. He chased it for strike two. I'm going to need to see a better game plan out of the hitter right here. That ball was at his eyes. Uh, they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Now bat, now bat. So striding forward now, J.J. Matajevic. In his last at-bat, he popped out in foul ground. Yeah, we used to have a saying right here, you would stride to the plate for this A.B. trying to chop wood. Not in today's game. You just want to get your bat plane on the same path of the ball. Can't continue to swing under those elevated heaters. Bases are empty, one man out. Popped up. Nay is there. And that's the second out of the inning. Digging in, Colton Shaver. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Two out, nobody on. Shaver. Taken, called, strike two. And now they're down to their final strike tonight. And this is pulled foul as he was way out in front there. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. And that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Yeah, this game was decided in the eighth. That was a huge offensive fireworks coming into the eighth inning. And when the other guys put up a big inning like that against you late in the game, it's really tough to make any kind of a comeback. 7 1, the final score in tonight's. The Travelers came through late, taking the lead in the eighth to secure the victory. Anthony Misevich earns his team leading 11th win. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game for the victorious Travelers: seven runs, eleven hits, no errors. They left seven men on base. 
for the hook. One run on two hits. One error. They left four men on base. Time of the ball game. Three hours exactly. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please drive home safely.